What's up, y'all? It's your boy Gord Dukes, and I'm back with y'all with the problem, man. We got a six month break from the One Piece anime. Now, I know y'all are struggling right now. Y'all are going through withdrawals right now, especially if you're reading the manga and you know how long it's going to take to get to these fucking crazy reveals. You know, we're getting into the next arc. Without saying too much, we're now bath bitch. <laughs> but bro, remember the feeling when you would read a chapter, right? And you would be saying to yourself, Oh, you know what? I can't wait to see this animated. They're about to pop off when this animated. But guess what? You're not going to see this shit animated for at least a year. And a half, maybe. Because it used to be a year, regularly, when the manga was at a, a good spot uh, apart from the anime but now it's gonna be way longer and that is just a trip I was at work the other day uh, a Saturday and I was like damn you know I'm getting my ass kicked at work I can't wait to go home relax watch a brand new episode of One Piece you know I work with someone else he's like oh new One Piece tonight and I was like no way there's no new One Piece tonight it's Fishman Island oh no <laughs> It's been my worst nightmare. It's Fishman Island reanimated. Yo, when they announced Fishman Island being reanimated, you know, redrawn, it's bullshit, dude. I'm not gonna lie. I'm sure it's cool, right? It's, it's One Piece Kai, Fishman Island edition. But the thing that I hate the most is probably what Star Wars fans were feeling when they remastered those, the original movies that came out, right? And then they gave him like CGI Jabba the Hutt. You know, I'm not a fan of Star Wars, but it's like CGI Jabba the Hutt, you know, the little furry monsters walking around. And then like the studio thought, this is what the fans want. They want the old movies just remastered. No, that's not what they want. And then you're probably sitting there like, not as a fan, me. Like, I was like, damn, that sucks for those guys. Like, I hope I never experienced something like that ever in my life. And then here we are, Fishman Island, remastered, redrawn, cut together, and taking the tension out of all the scenes, your favorite scenes. Luffy doing Conqueror's Hockey on the fake Luffy. And it was just super quick. They didn't let the scene breathe. And it's weird, man. It's not, it's not worth it. Aside from all that, the reason why I make this video is because you are not alone. You are tweaking, just like me. <laughs> We are going through withdrawals, so I'm going to help you through those withdrawals with some recommendations. Not just anime, but maybe some manga, but also other shit you can do. Maybe you can rent a boat and pretend you're a fin pirate, like Inyaki did, the guy who plays Fin Luffy in the live action. He like rented a boat, uh, went to the sea. I don't know if he really did it, but he did it after he filmed, which is crazy because if you want to get into character, you're supposed to do it before. This fool went on this went to the ocean and he's he was out there. And you know what? I'm sure like two hours in, he's like, oh, f why did I do this? <laughs> so maybe you can rent a boat, pretend you're a pirate, you know, don't drown. But, you know, get into the, the piratey spirit. Another thing is you could watch, you know, something you've never watched before. Now, I know there's a lot of anime that come out every season, but... You really have to like wait until the word of mouth gets around, right? But I'm here to recommend you, you know, what what shows to watch and what shows to avoid, you know, because every season there's always like a, oh, the haven't you heard of the can snorkeling isekai? I'm like, bro, you're not watching the can snorkeling isekai? You don't know about turtle chum? You don't know about turtle sama? Like, no, I'm not watching that book. First and foremost, if you haven't watched Hunter Hunter, go watch Hunter Hunter. Then watch Yu Yu Hakusho, back to back, and your life will change. You know, because One Piece takes up so much of our lives. It's been around for so long, and you probably, you know, if you're a new fan, you've watched a thousand episodes in a row. You know, you probably started reading the manga, which is even like another year's worth of content. So now you're just like, okay, let me take a break. Let me let me see what out there. You know, let's see, let me see what gives me the vibe, right? You know, you know what you should read, though? Toriko. If you wanted that sense of adventure, you know, with that, with also the occasional like, oh shit moment, you know, like the one page panels of people just being like, what the, like doing crazy feats, watch Toriko, Toriko, 
Now she'll fill you up. No pun intended. And you know what she'll watch after that? JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. If you're not watching JoJo, that's like a must watch. You need to have that under your king belt, okay? If you don't know who Dio Brando is, you know, aside from the meme, that mother is a living meme, all right? And his voice, aka Aokiji, one for the ages. This is the time to watch JoJo because part seven is coming out pretty soon. Any day now, they could announce it. Just waiting. I'm just, oh my God, I'm just waiting. And when they announce it, and when they show that f trailer with all those fucking horses, you know it's about to go down. If you see a fucking horse in the background and it says Jojo Bizarre Adventure in the front, it's about to go king down, man. Watch Jojo. This is your time. Catch up now. And if you've watched my channel, you've known that I've loved Sakamoto Days. So please get into Sakamoto Days because in January... The fucking anime is coming out and it's looking pretty spicy. Watch Sakamoto Days. It's up there. It's getting better and better and it's fun to read. I know I know some of you are just on your phone like this and you're just like, damn, I didn't have time to do anything today. I'll do it tomorrow. And you've been saying that every day because you're like, damn, I gotta watch another episode of One Piece. You know, I gotta get a gotta get gotta get a good two episodes in before another three episodes in, and then I got to shower, <laughs> I got to eat, got to do something. But then, oh shit, my favorite Twitch streamers that just got the notification that they went live right now. I'm like, oh, now I got to put One Piece on hold. And then when they're done, I can go back and watch more One Piece. And then I'll go to work. <laughs> you know what else you could do? You could pick up another hobby. One thing that is very expensive, but very fun is collecting cards. And they damn near make cards out of everything now. You've seen on my channel. Me opening Bleach Union Arena. They're making Hunter Hunter cards and Chainsaw Man cards. Jojo Bizarre Adventure cards. One Piece cards are been popping off. Pokemon cards. The OG, the GOAT, they still around. And they making bangers after bangers. Who else don't, who wouldn't want a f***ing Moonbryon? I've been f Evolving Skies is digging in my pocket right now. Surging Sparks coming out soon. Prismatic, whatever the f*** that. They look ugly. The f***ing crown Pokemon? Hell no, nah, man. And then Pokemon Pocket comes out. And then the f***ing Central League guy was like, yeah, the boosters are not random. As soon as you open it, you know, they pick the cards for you. And you're like, what the f***? That was half the fun is ripping packs online. Anyways, there are plenty of things to do out there. More animes, more TV shows. It doesn't have to be anime. Uh, movies, you know, you have a life to live. And one day, One Piece will come back. And when it does, it's like, oh, that delayed gratification is just going to hit so hard. that sa It's not even going to come back on a Saturday. You're going to have to adjust to a new schedule. And then the wit comes out. And the wit's going to blow your balls off, dude. But nah, I really don't know what to do. For six months. It feels like jail. <laughs> but yeah, let me know what you think. How are you coping? You know, what shows are you watching right now? You know, what are you doing to keep your mind off? Because I know for a lot of people, it's like, you know, it's like something you see after work or this and that. Something that you look forward to um, and it's kind of gone for a while. You could watch Fishman Island, but then you, you could fuck. Thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. Uh, I'll see you all next time. Peace.